This a reminder. This a reminder. To the feminine one. Oh! To the feminine one. Oh! To the feminine one. Hey y'all, it's Shauna B, your favorite fashionable realtor, and I am back. Y'all, I haven't did a vlog in I think it's been a couple weeks, but it is what it is. I'm gonna get it together. I'm gonna stay consistent. I told you I'm gonna stay consistent. So here's the vlog. Um, we are in the month of June. I think today's date right now is June 10th. I have had more packages come to our house from brands than I ever had before. So I just received my last package and I was like, let's do a PR unboxing. I went thrifting, I went shopping. I've had all this stuff just sitting in the corner for this video. And yeah, you know, your girl started off with thrifting. So I'm real happy to show y'all what I've thrifted. I haven't thrifted since we've been here because I'm not near a thrift store like how I wanna be. Y'all, I just be wanting to walk or a three minute drive. I hate driving. So I have not been thrifting like that. Your girl had recently sold a house um, near the old thrift store that I went to. So I was like, why not go thrifting? So yeah, this is what this is about to be about. Uh, so we finna hop right into it because I ain't trying to make this video all long, got and drawn, but I just want to let y'all know. And I am dead serious about this. Get on your Zoom. You gotta get on your Zoom, girls. You gotta get on your Zoom. Look here, when you stay consistent, and you if you want to be a content creator and you don't know where to start find your niche my niche when i first started was fashion so that's why i put fashion and real estate your favorite fashionable realtor that's why all of this is together but third thing is where i started at and it helped to me to like become your favorite fashionable realtor like i said but more so importantly, that was the beginning which helped me stay consistent. And by me staying consistent, I was able to learn how to mix both fashion and real estate together. So, yeah, you got to get on your Zoom. You got to get on your Zoom. I always start with the big ones, of course. <clears throat> My favorite brand, child. Oh. Not one. Two. This came right in time because I can pull up in the video, child. Poppy, he sent me two boxes of their delicious prebiotic, prebiotic soda. I love these because I am a person who likes to drink a lot of pop and sugary drinks. And these has helped me start winging off of drinking that. So yeah, your girl got strawberry lemonade is i think i had this one this is the watermelon i got ginger orange the raspberry rose i love these the great flavor in it ah, i'm so happy because i really got this okay the next packet my second collab with Touchland, these hand sanitizers. I love the fact that they're so little and cute. Of course, I got a pink case. And they long lasting. The crazy part is, y'all, take on my other two right here. Like, I am a big supporter of this brand. I always got one of these in my purse. So thanks, Touchland. I appreciate it. Marie Collagen Facial Masses. Six masks. So at least I got a lot. So I'll probably be using this tonight since I have not did um, like a deep, deep cleaning on my face. Like I'm using this tonight. So so it's like wipe this off. Thanks, Marie. I appreciate it. 
Oh, it's cute. I know that Good Molecules is found in Ulta Beauty. The brightening toner, overnight exfoliating treatment. This coloration serum, I need this because I have a scar on my face. Ultra hydrating facial oil, so together. So, Good Molecules. You can find this at Ulta Beauty. You can go on their website, but however, thank you Good Molecules. Melanin. So these are from Glow Melanin. And let me take them out the plastic. I don't want to break facial bar. Yeah, it's gonna be my skin gonna be on point, child. The goddess Yanni Oa with rose petals, specifically formulated for melanin skin. It has the the roses in here, yeah. And we have the peach Yanni wash. Oh, so you already know what this is. This will help brighten and you know the goddess area or whatever and we have the brightening turmeric scrub y'all so i i'm going to love this because turmeric actually works on my skin and i know for a fact i'll be using this every day or every other day as directed i'll say that glow melanin thank you yeah. real to a shout out because she most definitely hit me up in regards to wearing this shirt her name is so by sue and it's pink. They say I do real estate. So I really love this because your girl do do real estate. So I have this shirt and I most definitely will wear this. So thank you, Sue. I really right, for the next package. We have Posey. These are the poo poo foam shoes for like running around um, after workouts. Uh oh. I don't know for a fact I can style these. Anything pink, your girl is styling. But thank you, Posey. I really appreciate it. We got something from Toast. It's a non-alcoholic beverage. Wine. It's like a sparkling wine, but without the wine or the alcohol. You get know what I'm saying? They sent me the rose, the white tea, and a cranberry ginger. And, and I don't feel like drinking. I most definitely will toast to these. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Toast. I really appreciate it. Okay, uh, I know what y'all been waiting for. Let's recall. First thing, let's see. I got this cute skirt. It's like one of them workout tops. Why not pair it with a hat? So I was like, yeah, why not? Mm, let's try it on. Yeah, my booty be booting in because this skirt a lift. Any wrong move, it's over. A gym shoe or a heel. I actually thrifted this first last summer. So if I wanted to do the most, I could put a yellow scarf on here to pop off this hat or some pink earrings to blend all of them. But yeah, I do like the fact that this top Comes with like these breast pads, you know, for the ladies when it get cold or anything. Yeah, protect it and it's giving me like a Yeah, here's look one. All right, look two. We kept the top on because I, I, I already got makeup on, so I'll probably end up wearing this top today. You know that the slacks are in Zara for like $50, $60. Go to your local thrift store and get a good quality pair of men's like dress pants. $5. I got these for, let's see. I got these for $3.99. I always be gapping because I do have a smaller waist compared to how big this is. But heels, gym shoes, however you want to do it. Airport runs. You need to go to the grocery store. You may have to work and do something slight and you want to stay casual but still look cute and comfortable. Get your pedigree. I got like three or four of these. And the girlies who know and keep up with fashion know that the long skirts are like trending right now. Grandma or your mama most definitely donated a long skirt or two from the early 2000s. Love this skirt. The only thing is, of course, same thing. It's a gap, but it's nothing that a seamstress cannot fix. I can't always, you know, just wear like this on, put a belt around it. Over accessorized, uh, special top, some gym shoes um, with this, of course, a hat, lots of bangles, a big chain, oversized earrings to give this a pop. I said I did find an outfit to go with this, so hold on. I found an outfit. Well, 
this is the outfit literally this whole outfit will be thrifted this top was thrifted i don't know if i will wear this shirt i would probably actually close this but however because i don't want to take this white top off i just left it but um you see how i actually like formatted this to actually go with this even with the white shirt if i wanted to i can most definitely wear it like this because there is like a white lining on the skirt that can bounce off this white but if like i said two dollars I'll probably throw a bold purse on to complement these colors. Thrifty for less than probably $30, I'll say. And like I said, this skirt can be worn multiple ways. Shoot, the top can even be worn multiple ways. So get you a string skirt. I will not be messing up my brand new shirt. Got this skirt, thrifted it, of course, but it is a gap. However, it can be, this top will go very well with this actually keep the go heel and over accessorize y'all if you don't know by now i love to over accessorize so i most definitely will go probably like a yellow purse or so just because i see that yellow is like the brighter color in this when i seen this skirt i had already knew the type of shirt i had seen this shirt in the camera before i went to the thrift store so i already knew how i was gonna pair this skirt when i said i wanted to wear it like this i could like, it's so many ways that people can style certain pieces and still don't have to overdo it if you're not the person that like overdo it then you could have actually just kept it like this some sandals and call it a day because i'm trying to be your favorite professional realtor i'm gonna overdo it honey